Okay. Mm -hmm. On the count of three, mm -hmm. say prom. One, two. Mm -hmm. Mr. Derringer. Mi Mr. Derringer, might I remind you that this is a school event. Hands where I can see them. My apologies, Lunch Lady Belinda. The beauty of this creature here often causes me to act in a way that is, well, less than appropriate. Oh my, somebody's gonna be walking very funny tomorrow morning. Well, my dear sweet morsel, shall we proceed? One, two, three. Prom! Um. Oh, bonjour, lunch lady Belinda. <sighs> Hello, Cezanne Marguerite. Please embrace Blaine in a romantic yet appropriate manner. Um, actually, I've prepared a speech. For a picture? <clears throat> Cezanne Marguerite, tonight I consider myself the luckiest man on the face of the earth. Did you just steal Lou Gehrig's retirement speech? What? No! She completes me! That's Jerry Maguire. Hey, I'm real! What you get is what you see. What you trying to do to me? Those are the lyrics to an old Jennifer Lopez song. Uh, Blaine, straight up now tell me, do you want to love me forever? Or am I caught in a hit and run? Ugh, you give love a bad name. What? Oh, God damn it! now you got me doing it. What? what? Uh, forget it. The babies you make tonight are going to be so stupid. Just say prom. Prom. What do you say, prom? Hello, and welcome to the 2012 Overland Park High School Prom. All dogs go to heaven under the sea in Hawaii. <laughs> my, my. That's quite a unique theme for a high school prom. Yeah, we had some issues on the prom committee this year. Under the sea! Hawaii! Under the sea! Hawaii! Hey, hey guys, is my all dogs go to heaven theme still on the table because of... I think it's a real winner. A compromise was reached. Let's go get some punch. Hello, and welcome to the 2012 Overland Park. Oh my god, look at your outfit. I swear, if I was into ladies, I'd be elbow deep in you right now. Hello. You don't know me, Tristan McKee. I go to Blue Valley Northwest. Well, that's what I do during the day. At night, this one plays around in my guts. Yay. I'm Tanner Christensen. The answer to a question I never asked. You're probably familiar with Tanner's work. Well, not in the way I'm familiar with it. <laughs> I'm talking about sex. Sweetie, what's the name of that thing you are again? I'm the quarterback of the football team, Tristan. So much technical jargon. Jesus Louises. Leave us ladies in the kitchen where we belong, right, Red? I'm just kidding. Avi. I'm being paid $50 to stand here, not to talk to Rip Taylor's bottom. Go away now. <laughs> God, isn't she great? She's like the love child of Daria and Miranda from Sex in the City. Don't say what you're about to say. I've had this dream several times where Cynthia Nixon and I are dating, except she has a penis. Side note, it's huge. And in this dream, she repeatedly just, God, I'm getting wet just thinking about it. Come here, you. <sighs> now, just try and tell me that that was a second right hand job. It was cool. Damn right it was cool. Now, time to go in there and take my rightful place as... What the fuck? Later. Welcome to the 2012 Overland Park. Why are you wearing a tuxedo? Hey! Yeah. Why am I wearing a tuxedo? It's a women's cut. Did that come with a balls and a dick or did you buy that separately? Bridget, do you like my dress? You look like a tampon that was dipped in Skittles and vomit. Thank you. Hello, and welcome- Back off! Don't mind if I do. Hey. Huh? Um, that's my boyfriend. Yeah, that's what you get, Ashley Cachadorian. Next time, you watch the fucking door! Why are you guys so mean to me? <laughs> uh -huh. You know she's in charge of snacks, right? Uh, wait, what? Ashley Kachadorian is in charge of snacks. Uh, Jenna Darabont is in charge of the door. Oh my god, I made a terrible mistake. Excuse me, can someone explain to me why I just saw a bottom right of the pyramid running away from you two in tears? <laughs> I may have 
accidentally blamed Ashley Kachadorian for a certain girl getting her arms ripped off debacle. And I made out with her boyfriend. Not mistakenly. Oh, wait a minute. You made out with Justin Michelson? Yeah. Why? Do you have a problem with that? No. No. I mean, why would I have a problem with that? I don't care who Justin Michelson makes out with. There's nothing between us. I'm in a happy, committed relationship with Stephen Carmichael. So. <laughs> uh, so we're sure that Ashley Kachadorian is not in charge of the door? Because because we need to be like, sure. Sure, sure. God damn it, Trisha! This is supposed to be my night! Your night? I'm sorry. Since when does the night belong to the girl who's going to come in second for prom queen? Oh, you take that back, bitch. I take nothing back. Take it back! Wow, wow, wow. Sounds like there's discord on Chair Mountain. Hey, Van Buren, why the hell did you bring Jonathan Glitzenhammer as your prom date? Hey, that's, that's not, not my name. name. Never mind. I get it. Hey, girl with the black hair, I don't need to stand here and be berated by the likes of you. Than is popular now, and Than is going to hang out with the rest of the popular dudes. Yo, dudes, wait up. Fuck off. Fuck off. As off the butts. Uh, that's just an inside joke we have. Popular guy thing. No, it's not. <laughs> Fuck you too there, buddy. <laughs> Those guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just... You want some punch? I'll be right back. What the fuck was that? Oh my god, Deandra. It's... It's so good to see you. Can I just say, um... <laughs> I love your dress. It's the exact same dress I've been wearing every day to school. No, no, I know, but it's... It's it's so good today. Well, um... It's really nice to see that you've really kept a positive attitude about all this. Uh, yeah. Things are fucking awesome for me. I had to run the 100 meters in the Special Olympics. I lost like 27 pounds. Oh my god, what is your secret? I had my arms ripped off. Oh, oh. <gasps> right. And tonight, I get to be the prom queen. I'm sorry, excuse. Did you say that you're going to be prom queen? Uh, yeah, look at me. Exactly, look at you. Mackenzie Dale, Shea Van Buren, hand job girl. You clearly aren't familiar with the concept of a pity vote, are you? Put yourself in the shoes of an average Overland Park student. Who are you going to vote for for prom queen? A cheerleader? Perhaps. An Overland Park socialite? Maybe. Oh, but wait, what's this? A girl with no arms? Well, if I don't vote for her, I most assuredly will burn in the fiery fire of hellfire for all eternity. In fact, let me vote for her twice to ensure that she never experiences heartbreak or disappointment ever again in her entire life. After all, she does have no arms. Bada bop. One, two, eight, prom queen. Your attention, please. Will the five students nominated for prom queen please make their way to the front of the stage? Prom has been going for eight minutes, which of course means it's time for the most important event of the evening. See you up there, dumb whores.